Okay, this is a video showing um, the battery and the charging voltage on this CX500 Turbo 1982 model. So I added a relay here and now have the regulator output going straight in here to the battery. Um, you'll see what that charging voltage is here in a minute. Um, the relay gets switched when you turn the key on so that this isn't pulling a current and draining the battery when the engine is shut off. Um, right now you can see battery voltage is around 12.94. Engine's not running. So I added a voltmeter up here and what we want to do is see what that shows. It's going to show a lower reading than what's back at the battery, but it'll still give you a good indication if your battery system is charging properly. So let's go ahead and we'll turn it on. And you can see this is reading like 10 volts up here. And if we come down here, we're seeing 12.1 something because we got the lights on now and the engine's not running. Um, you can see the lights. Okay, they're on. So now we'll start the bike. We'll start drying up every time. And uh, now you can see my charging voltage is at 14 and a half, which is a good charging voltage. Before I put the relay in and did the wiring directly from the sense wire to the battery positive, it was charging at about 15.1, 15. .1, 15 which is a little bit high, and I didn't want it to be that high, so I went ahead and pulled that down with the direct sense going to the battery. That way it's not overcharging the battery. And up here, you can see that we get 12.4 up here. And even if we increase the RPM of the engine, Regulator's doing its job, as is the stator. 